Hello, I am Tonmoy Dev and my partner's name is Aditya Karmogar and our guide's name is Shukanto Shaha. We are from Tripura, uh, from the school Udaipur English Medium Higher Secondary School. We are from Gumuti district of Tripura. Our exhibit's name is uh, a low cost method of measuring the height of any object without using any tape and without using the base. Now, this is our model. Here, uh, for generally to measure the height of any object, we use the height and distance technique based on trigonometry. So, in this case, we require a base length and an angle for uh, measuring the height. Here, let us suppose we will measure the height of this building. Here, the base length is 40 cm and this angle is alpha. Suppose. Now, according to trigonometry, we get 10 alpha equal to h by 40 cm. Therefore, by putting the value of alpha in this uh, identity, we can easily get the height of this house. Now, this was the general concept and this is our new concept. In this concept, we will use uh, two angles and the distance between them to measure the height of uh, any object. We will not use the total uh, base length. This is the twist in our model. Uh, now, let us suppose we will measure the height of this tree. Here, these two protectors makes angle alpha and beta with the top of the tree. Here, the distance between these two protectors is 20 cm. Now, according to our model, the height of the tree is given by 20 cm divided by cot alpha minus cot beta. The verification of the formula is given here. Here you can see there are two triangles, triangle ABC and triangle ABD. These are two right angle triangles. Here, uh, let us suppose we will measure the height of this AB, which is H let, and there are two angles alpha and beta. Now, from triangle ABC, we get cot alpha equal to x plus 1 by H, or x plus 1 equal to H cot alpha, or x equal to H cot alpha minus 1, which is named as 1. And from triangle ABD, we get cot beta equal to x by h or x equal to h cot beta, which is named as 2. By combining this 1 and 2, we get uh, h equal to 1 by cot alpha minus cot beta. Here, this distance that is between uh, the distance between DC is mentioned as 1 for making it a standardized formula. Uh, so, by knowing the angles of alpha and beta, we can easily find height of any object. Let us suppose we will find the height of this partition. Uh, for finding the uh, height of this partition, at first we will have to know the value of this alpha and beta. So we are using these two protectors and this laser light for measuring these angles. Here, this laser light makes an angle 30 degree with the top of the partition, which is alpha here. And this protector makes an angle 47 degree with the top of the partition. So this is beta here. So by putting the values of alpha and beta in this formula, that is h equal to 1 by cot alpha minus cot beta, we can easily get height of anything. And uh, the value of cot alpha and cot beta, uh, for getting the value of cot, uh, cot alpha and cot beta, we can use scientific calculator or cot tables. And this is a low cost project and these two round shaped uh, protectors, small protectors are used for measuring height of any object which is lower than the height of this project. So this is a very much low cost project and it is a totally new technique and we can use it for measuring uh, the height of any building, any mountain etc or the sea depth also and this is our project.